Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. A while ago on my um, model airplane fields, we were talking about safely charging and storing lipos. Uh, now I'm using one of these uh, 50 caliber munition boxes where I just have my lipos in there and I usually charge them in here also. Now, this is not very safe, apparently, I found out. Because this box has this rubber seal in it along, along the lid here. Uh, you can see it's, it's only partly in here because I took out half of it. And when you close the box, that turns it into a bomb. When one of these lipos goes off, the, uh, the gases can't escape the box and it'll turn it into a little bomb. And also there's nothing in this box that will quench the fire. So what I did is I went on eBay. I bought three more of these potential bombs and I bought a A bucket of these um, fire quenching pearls. I bought it on uh, on Amazon, I think. It, it's a 10 liter bucket. Uh, it cost me 35 euros. Uh, now these these pearls, they um, if, when they get hot, they melt together, and um, they quench the fire in doing so. So my plan now is to use a household vacuuming machine, whatever you call these, you, you, you vacuum your food in the, with these things, with bags, and then use um, these uh, plastic uh, freezer bags, because the, the plastic that comes with these machines is too thick, and um, so use these plastic vacuum bags to make small bags filled with the pearls, and then I'll put one bag in the bottom of this box, put the lipos on top, and another bag on top of the lipos. And to make it safe for the gases to escape when a lipo is burning, I've removed the rubber seal out of the lid. There's a rubber seal going all around normally. So I've removed this part of the seal and this part of the seal because it needs the little rubber part here and the rubber part there to close properly. So that's what I'm gonna do now. So in order to fill the bags, I've got a scale here. I wanna fill them with about 300 grams of these pearls. It's about right. A little more. Just a little more. There we go. So, now we'll remove as much air as possible. And then just put it in the machine. And weld the plastic. There we go. One welded bag. Now I always like to add an extra weld. Just for safety. There we go. Two welds right next to each other. This is one that I prepared earlier. And you just take the box. Put in one bag, lipos on top, and another bag on top of that. And now you can safely close the lid after you've removed 
the rubber seal from this part and this part of the lid. The top part you need to close it properly. And I also found that it, it opens and closes better if you leave the bottom part. But as long as this part of the rubber seal is gone, it is safe enough. There we go. I hope this helps uh, somebody. Um, I think this is a lot safer this way. And um, from now on, I'm going to charge and um, transport my lipos this way only. Thanks for watching.